Slavoj Zizek's essay, Did Somebody Say Totalitarianism? Five Interventions in the Khmiz, Use of a Notion, delves into the multifaceted concept of totalitarianism, highlighting the complexities surrounding its definition and the problematic ways it has been employed in political discourse. Through five distinct interventions, Zizek challenges the oversimplified use of the term totalitarianism and encourages a more nuanced understanding. Zizek begins by elucidating the historical and conceptual origins of totalitarianism. He asserts that the term initially emerged in the 20th century to describe regimes like Nazi Germany and Stalinist Soviet Union, where oppressive ideologies and mass surveillance were prevalent. However, he contends that the term's contemporary usage often stretches beyond its original meaning, encompassing any form of authoritarianism, thereby diluting its analytical power. Zizek suggests that this misuse allows for a dangerous oversimplification of complex political dynamics. The first intervention delves into the question of whether totalitarianism is an exclusively modern phenomenon. Zizek argues that this view oversimplifies history and overlooks the existence of oppressive systems in pre-modern societies. By broadening the scope, he emphasizes the importance of understanding the historical continuity of authoritarianism, challenging the idea that totalitarianism is solely a product of modernity. The second intervention tackles the conflation of totalitarianism with authoritarianism. Zizek criticizes the tendency to label any authoritarian regime as totalitarian, arguing that this blurs crucial distinctions. Authoritarianism, he posits, implies the presence of an authority figure or institution, while totalitarianism suggests a totalizing ideology that permeates all aspects of life. By emphasizing these differences, Zizek urges a more accurate application of these terms. Zizek's third intervention focuses on the Western obsession with totalitarianism, often portraying it as an external threat. He contends that this obsession serves as a diversion tactic, deflecting attention from internal problems within Western democracies. In doing so, he cautions against the simplistic narrative of the West as the bulwark against totalitarianism, urging self-reflection on the erosion of democratic principles within Western societies. The fourth intervention critiques the over-reliance on psychoanalysis in understanding totalitarianism. While acknowledging the insights offered by psychoanalysis, Zizek argues that reducing totalitarianism to a psychological phenomenon oversimplifies the intricate socio-political factors at play. He advocates for a more comprehensive approach that incorporates political, economic, and cultural dimensions, cautioning against reducing complex historical phenomena to mere psychological analysis. In the final intervention, Zizek addresses the potential dangers of overusing the term totalitarianism. He argues that this overuse can lead to desensitization, diminishing the gravity of genuine instances of totalitarianism. By indiscriminately labeling various regimes as totalitarian, we risk diluting the term's significance and failing to recognize the true horrors of totalitarian rule. In conclusion, Zizek's essay, Did Somebody Say Totalitarianism? Five Interventions in the Ms. Use of a Notion challenges the oversimplification and misuse of the concept of totalitarianism in contemporary discourse. Through five interventions, he urges a more nuanced understanding of the term, emphasizing its historical continuity, the distinction between authoritarianism and totalitarianism, and the dangers of overusing it. By engaging with Zizek's interventions, readers are prompted to reevaluate their perceptions of totalitarianism and approach the term with greater precision and caution in political analysis.